What's up, YouTube? CJD here from Chris's Junkyard Designs. I'll go through some finds I got in the past couple days. Getting a little lucky. Um, no main lines, though, for Hot Wheels. Can't find any new main lines. It's the only thing I can't get. But i um, been doing good with other stuff, though, so I'm very happy with that. So we'll start off first. These are all Walmart, too, everything. Um, I haven't been able to get to any other stores yet. So we'll start off with an Auto World. There were some, a couple new mixes in there. I only got one car though. I already have the Plumage Voyager that I wanted from that set. So, and a couple other things. So I got this 66 Oldsmobile 442 in Autumn Bronze Poly. This thing looks freaking sweet. So I had to grab that. I love these muscle cars. The vintage muscle cars love that series so had to grab that nice red line around the tires thing looks sweet oh, that was cool i found that today i don't know what else is in this set the mitsubishi they had i didn't want the voyager i have the wrangler already got the Silverado I already have, and they had the Firebird, but I didn't like the Firebird either, so. This was the only other one I wanted, so I'll wait for the new mixes to come out. And we got some Moving Parts Matchbox, some new ones. 96 Mitsubishi Lancer Evolution. Four. I have the other color, I think it was white, but I don't remember. Good engine detail on this piece. So I can't wait to crack that and take a look at that. That's a cool casting. <clears throat> and this is a new casting. This Bollinger. I guess it's some electric thing. I don't know. But it looked cool. So I figured I'd give it a try and take a look at it. It's in matte black. Uh, I remember seeing it on Lamley. Something like you can open something to go straight through or something. I don't remember. Mm -hmm. Tailgate, I think. <clears throat> I don't know. I'm going to take a look. We'll um, see what it does. The Bollinger B2. Let's see what that's all about. And then I got this awesome thing. This is really cool. Um, I believe I have it in red. I don't think I have it in the silver. I hope I don't. I don't think I do. That is. But yeah, that is freaking awesome. Yeah, I don't have this one. So, on the 70th anniversary, love this fire truck. Very cool. So, very happy to get that. And I grabbed this Rebel with the opening hood. It looked pretty cool. I believe I have another one like this. I'm not positive if I have this casting or not. Very cool looking. Uh, hold on one minute, guys. Okay, I'm back. All right, and now let's get to some Hot Wheels that I found. Found this whole set. Grab them all. This is number one. This is that Forza set. Porsche 911 GT3. Best one out of the set, of course. It's my opinion it is. Very cool looking. And this yellow color, gold color. Very nice. It's the back of the car. I'm sure everybody's seen this by now. But got the whole thing today. BMW Z4M Motorsport. This one's pretty sweet too. I like the coloring on it. Uh, for three bucks, they should have did all the tampos though. The front headlights and the rear would have been nice. That's just a sweet looking car. That's number two. Number three, another casting I collect, the Jaguar F-Type Project 7. This beautiful green. I think we have it in the green already, but this one's nicely tampoed up, done up. 
the rear and the front like it should be. And it looks like a beautiful green. So very sweet on that one. And number four is the Bugatti EB110SS. Looks pretty sweet. Oh, the Bugatti for the collection. I don't think I have too many of this casting from Hot Wheel. I know I got a few from Matchbox. I want to get that new exclusive yellow one in the nine pack. That one looks cool. Yeah, this is sweet. That would be number four. The card art's pretty cool on these two. And number five, I almost didn't get it, but I said, eh, I got some of them, so I might as well get it to complete the set, I guess. And it had cool graphics on it, and it's fully tampoed. If it wasn't fully tampoed, I wouldn't have grabbed it. But this isn't my favorite car, but I do have a few of them, so. Get the fours. Uh, the red tires I thought looked cool. The red on the hood looked cool, so I grabbed it. So, not bad. The Alfa Romeo GC competition zone, competition, whatever the hell it's called. Yeah, so that's number five. Then we got the race day set. There's a few sets there. Uh, no chase, of course, but complete set. Doesn't look like people are interested in this set at all. Not by me, anyway. So, we got the Porsche 935. I am interested in it. I think it looks awesome, this set. And I like how there's number one, and that'll be the second car. It's behind it on the card, which I'm sure everybody knows already, too. But this is a nice addition to the collection. This Porsche is sweet. So, that's number one, the Porsche 935. There's the back. <clears throat> sweet set. Number two, probably everybody's least favorite, but I like it. I think it's cool. Aston Martin Vantage GTE. Nicely done. Nice wheels. Red lights done up, of course. There's your number two. Sign up one, number three, the Audi R8 LMS. This one looks pretty sweet too. I like the <clears throat> graphics on it look really cool. Wheels are nice. Yeah. That one's pretty sweet. And we'll take a look at these. Maybe I'll do these Thursday for premium showcase tomorrow. Might as well. If I can get it open and get it put away. So that's done. And this one's awesome. Um, this is probably, I think, my favorite out of the set. Ford Capri GR5. This thing looks freaking awesome. I guess this is a new casting. I believe it's a new casting. That is an awesome looking race car. I love the wheels on it. Yeah. I can't wait to get this one out. Team Ford. Yeah. Pretty nice. And number five is another nice. It's probably my second favorite. 94 Mercedes. 84 AMG. EMT touring car. This thing is badass looking too. The Egypt livery. That's cool looking. Probably the Capri, this, and the Porsche are my top three. But that is a cool looking race car. Yeah. So pretty sweet. And that will do it for what I found in the past few days. So we'll be opening this stuff up soon and taking a closer look at it. Which is always fun. So I'll probably open some cars tonight and do a recent craft video for tomorrow. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, thanks again for all the likes and the comments. Take care and have a great night.